Okay, so today we will learn designing a push down automata. Taking an example of the language a par n, b par n. Okay, so we all know that in a push down automata we have a stack. Okay, so the first step that we have to do that we have to push an empty symbol the z0 in the stack. This z0 indicates that the stack is empty. Okay, so the first transition for every uh, push down automata will be transition starting from a state Q0. This is the input symbol that is we are not giving any of the input symbols. And this is the value at the top of the stack before Z0 is put. The stack is empty. There is no value, right? So the value at the top of the stack is top of the stack. This is the input symbol. Okay, and this is the state. And uh, this will lead me to another state Q0. And this is what this is indicating that stack is empty. So when we when I make this first transition, the value Z0 is pushed into the stack. Okay, so now after this, what I need to do for I analyze that for every A that I push into the stack, okay, I'll have one B basically in a push down automata. We push the symbols into the stack and then with the help of another symbol, we keep on popping the data. Okay, so first of all, we'll write down the uh, trans uh, transitions for the pushing of A into the stack. So second of my transition will be transition Q0. This is called the present state. Okay, when we make the table for it, we'll be using there. The present state comes over here. Then the input symbol is now A. The top of the stack contains Z0 will be equal to what? Q1. Why Q1? Because the state change takes place whenever my input symbol changes. Input symbol has changed from null to A, so my state will change. And the stack will now have A, Z0. Or you can also write down A. Hardly makes any difference. A, Z0 is better. Then you take third transition. Now I have A in the stack. Now suppose the string is A, A, B, B. Okay. So this has been pushed into the stack. Now my turn for this A. So transition q1 comma a comma the top of the stack has a same state same input symbol so there will be no change of state and a a z naught okay now my comes b now there's b right so there will be a change of state plus now the top of stack has a now i'll do popping right why because i have to now i have inserted two a's in the stack now when a B will enter the stack, that B should pop an A. Then another B will come, it should pop an A with it, right? So this thing and popping is always Y Q2 because input symbol has changed and popping is always denoted by null over here. This thing is not the value in the top of this. Uh, this is not the value in the stack. This simply indicates that popping has taken place. This is the pushing. This is the popping. Now okay so the last uh, you can say step that will take place you can also say that q2 comma b comma a gives me q2 comma null so this is what a repetition of steps right so you can simply take a single step okay so the last one will be you can say the fifth one now because this one is excluded will be that q2 okay no input symbol will go the top of the stack would contain z0 and the uh, automator has to reach a final state that's it that is now totally now totally the stack will become empty no z0 no a nothing is there in the stack and since my stack is empty so the language is the string is accepted okay so now we have to make a table for it right so what we do, we take a string, uh, for example, the we make write down the serial number, okay, the state, input, unread input, okay, the stack and the transitions used, okay. So the unread input, input let it be A, A, B, B. So this, the top of the stack initially has what? Has Z0. 
ठीक है एंड देन दिस हैज बिन डन यूजिंग द फर्स्ट ट्रांजिशन द टॉप ऑफ द स्टैक जेड नॉट हैज बिन पोजिशन टू बेट यूजिंग विच ट्रांजिशन द फर्स्ट वन सो वी राइट डाउन वन ओवर हियर ओके एंड द स्टेट द प्रेजेंट स्टेट इज क्यू नॉट दीज आर द स्टेट दिस क्यू नॉट क्यू वन दीज स्टेट वी राइट डाउन हियर दिस इज द क्यू नॉट ओके दिस इज सीरियल नंबर वन देन फॉर द सेकेंड वन नाउ आई टेक वन ए आई टेक वन ए एंड देन आई पुश दैट ए इन टू द स्टैक सो माई एंड्रेड इनपुट इज ए बी बी एंड माई स्टैक हैज दिस यूजिंग द ट्रांजिशन दिस वन बिकॉज द टॉप ऑफ द स्टैक हैज जेड नॉट इनपुट सिंपल वॉज ए सो माई ट्रांजिशन सेकेंड इज यूज ओके एंड द स्टेट इज क्यू वन नाउ कमिंग टू द थर्ड वन नाउ द टॉप ऑफ द स्टैक हैज ए इन इट टॉप ऑफ द स्टैक हैज ए इन इट इनपुट सिंपल इज ऑल्सो ए सो ट्रांजिशन थर्ड विल बी यूज एंड दिस माई एंड्रॉइड इनपुट विल बी ए सेट नॉट ओके एंड द स्टेट यूज इज अगेन क्यू वन नाउ वेन आई टॉक अबाउट द फोर्थ वन ओके सो द एंड्रॉइड इनपुट विल बी बी बट नाउ वॉट वी डू वेन द इनपुट इज बी एंड द टॉप ऑफ द स्टैक हैज ए सो वी पॉप इट दैट इज वन ऑफ द एज विल बी पॉप्ड from the stack this is using transition 4 okay and the state becomes q2 then again the popping has to take place why because the input symbol is b and when the top of the stack has a okay so we pop we pop okay so again q2 state and uh, the popping takes place the stack has now what does the stack have now null so z not and transition 4 now the stack has z not Input symbol is null, so I have to reach a final Q F state. That is the sixth and the last row, the Q F state, null. The stack also becomes empty, and that I have done using five. So that's all about it. I hope it's clear. If not, you can ask in the comment section. Thank you for watching.